And now, First Warn 5 Weather with meteorologist Andrew Chung. Hey everyone, turned out to be a pretty nice afternoon with some sunshine and temperatures back in the 70s and 80s. But this morning when you woke up, it was chilly. We had a low temperature in West Laco of 49 degrees and for several hours a temperature of 49 degrees. Tonight it's not going to be as chilly, but it will be cool with overnight lows in the mid 60s. Here's a satellite picture. The dark colors indicate the clouds. We saw lots of clouds for the first half of the day. Then finally some sunshine for the afternoon. Now some clouds are coming back for this late afternoon and early evening, especially for the mid and lower valley. Look at the temperatures right now. We're back in the lower 80s out west in Rio Grande City, upper 70s in McAllen and Edinburgh, mid 70s in West Laco, Harlingen and Raymondville, actually 69 degrees in Port Isabel and 72 in Brownsville. And now those winds, they've come back from the east to southeast, and that means it's going to be more humid for tonight. The wind speeds are between 9 to 14 miles an hour. Here's your evening plan or forecast. Notice a bit of sun. Some of you will see some sunshine for this early evening. Other people will see more clouds for the start of this evening. 74 degrees, not too bad at 7 p.m. 70 degrees at 9 p.m., partly to mostly cloudy. And then mostly cloudy at 11 o'clock tonight with temperatures down to 68 degrees. Here's that surface map. The front is now stalled out over the Gulf of Mexico. That's the same one that it came through yesterday. And then we have flow coming from the east to southeast, making it more humid. Take a look at this. Here's a warm front draped over West Texas and the Texas Panhandle. So ahead of the front, the temperatures right now still cool. Look at this. A Texas divided by a two temperature zones right now. 64 degrees in Austin, but behind the front, 95 in Midland, 88 degrees in El Paso. Right now, 79 Del Rio and 80 degrees in Laredo. So here is future track. The front that's over the Gulf of Mexico starts to move off to the east and northeast as a warm front. That front out west starts to come down. It's another cool front for us. This comes in by Monday night, actually early Tuesday morning. So tomorrow during the day, there is just a slight chance for some showers here in the valley. Then there's a better chance of some showers and thunderstorms tomorrow night and early Tuesday morning as the front comes through. Then there's still a chance for some leftover showers Tuesday morning behind the front. It is going to be a little bit cooler. This is not a very strong front as the high temperatures will only be in the upper 70s for Tuesday. Then things warm up for Wednesday. The sun comes back for Wednesday. High temperatures back in the 80s. It's even warmer for Thursday and Friday and also breezy as the front comes back to the north as a warm front. But hang on, yet another cool front comes and we think by Saturday during the day that may mean cooler weather just in time for Saturday afternoon and for Sunday. So up and down, up and down those temperatures go for the next seven days. On the water, we've got winds out of the north shifting to the southeast at 5 to 15 knots. The bay waters are moderate chop. Your next tide is a low tide at 422 tomorrow morning in the seas will be two to five feet. So for tonight, cool, not as cool as last night. 66 the magic number. We'll have mostly cloudy skies, especially for the overnight hours. Now for tomorrow, we're going to go with a 20% chance of some showers in the afternoon, followed by a 40% chance of showers and thunderstorms tomorrow night and Tuesday morning, but no severe weather is expected. 84 is your high temperature for tomorrow. We'll have winds out of the east to southeast at five to 15 miles an hour. So here's that seven day forecast. Some days cooler, some days warmer. We're down to we're up to 84 degrees tomorrow, down to 68 tomorrow night, then only 76 on Tuesday. Again, there was a 40% chance of some showers in the morning on Tuesday. Maybe some more sunshine by Tuesday afternoon. Should be very nice though on Wednesday and not humid, mostly sunny with a high temperature of 83. Oh, when you wake up Wednesday morning, even cooler, down to 58 degrees to start. We're back to 87 on Thursday. It's breezy and warm Thursday and Friday with highs both days in the upper 80s. And at this point, we'll put in a 30% chance of some showers and thunderstorms on Saturday. Thanks to another front, we think high temperatures will be back to the mid 80s on Saturday, then upper 70s by next Sunday. That's your first Warren 5 forecast. Now here's Joel with a look at sports.